everybody it is Margaret and welcome to my channel Texas Gal Treasures and if you are here to see how to list shirt faster on Merch by Amazon you're in the right place I have been working on uploading political campaign shirts so you're gonna get a little sneaky peek into some of the things that I'm doing so it's okay I yeah anyway but I wanted to show you uh, something it's on the Merch Informer Lister it really, really, really speeds up the listing. So even though Merch by Amazon now has a creating multiple listings, there's still a faster way because I create multiples of shirts uh, to, to scale. You know, so I might make eight different designs all around, say, Elizabeth Warren or Donald Trump or whoever. And so that can get tedious, plus when I upload one design, I'm going to upload it onto two listings because I want to get a standard and a premium going. So I'm, there was a lot of copy and pasting, a lot of copy and pasting down here, even though it's still only for, um, it's going across all these. There's still a faster way, and if you know anything about merch and making money, Time is money, so the more time you can spend designing and coming up with ideas and the less time you have to deal with uploading and getting all the content written in there, the better. Okay, so let me show you what I do. So I'm going to come over. First of all, you got to sign up for Merch Informer. I think they've got a sale going on right now. That my window didn't pop up, so I'll have to look and see. But I've got a link down below, so you can check out my link. And then you're going to go to, so when you sign up here, then you can also do this Chrome extension. It's right here, Merch Informer Lister. So you pop it up, and then it, it comes into here. So basically, what I do, this is my, the two shirts, because I'll do, um, let me show you real quick. I'm going to open it up. So this is where I can set my prices for all the shirts. I can put in my product details for all of my shirts. And I'm going to show you what this little bracket with the one and the two is in just a second. It comes in super duper handy, especially when you're changing out like one word in a bunch of different listings. Because as you know, there's like 20 million Democratic nominees right now. Um, so I don't want to have to redo go in and copy and paste um, for each name. So this is going to be what these little numbers are for. And then I, I select all the shirt colors I want here. And then I have a second listing with all the same information because then I just have the standard and premium shirts because there's a lot more options. So I upload that again just on those two styles to get it um, on the other colors. So then down here you'll see where it says hotkey S. So basically that means when I hit the button S, that information is going to populate into my listing. So I want to make sure over here that I say active, yes, active, yes. And then I come over here to key keyword spinner. That's where these little numbers are going to come in. You can see my mermaid one up here. I was doing some mermaid shirts. And then here, so I've already worked on Elizabeth Warren shirts. So I have Warren in number one spot. And then anywhere there's a number two bracket, it'll put her full name in, Elizabeth Warren. So same thing here, I've been working on Yang, and I can put in Yang's name for one and number two for his full name. So let's come back over here so you can see what I'm talking about. All right, so I've got my design uploaded, so now I need to go in and knock out my hotkey. So basically what the hotkey is, is I'm gonna hit that equal sign, and it's gonna populate all of this stuff for me for my shirt. So here we go. I'm hitting that equal button and you'll see that it says I'm thinking, I'm doing all this stuff. Look at me go, here I go. Okay, wonderful. So now I can scroll down, I can see, look, it's got all this information and then it still has the one and the two in there because I haven't hit my other hotkey yet. So my other hotkey for Yang is hotkey number one. Make sure it's active. Another thing I do is I come over and I turn off the hotkeys over here because I have accidentally hit the hotkey again and it just like ah I mean it's not a big deal but it just like start over so here now I come and I hit my hotkey number one so watch hotkey number one it's gonna fill in those names for one and two so there we go the only problem I've been having is that the product description always says it's invalid so what I do real quick is I just copy it and did a, a command a for all and then command C for copy and then I just come up here 
and I paste it in and it, it holds it all. And then I come and I just grab it back out and then I pop it back in and it fixes it. So I don't know if there's an easier way, but that's pretty easy. And then I take this and I just copy that and I boom, 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 post it across the, all of them. One other thing I do real quick is I go through, see how this one's white on white. I'll go through and make sure I don't have white on white or black on black um, so that it doesn't show up, you know, if it doesn't show up right. So like this one, I'll have to do it. Boom, 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 boom. And then this one's good to go. And then boom, right? So then I can go across and do, because I have eight listings, you know, for this one candidate and it is ready to roll. So I hope you found this video helpful. It really speeds up listing times, especially when you're listing something similar. Um, and then all I have to do is come in and just make a new hotkey for a new candidate and plug it in for each one. And then boom, they're all up there and it's super fast. And hopefully they sell a million, million shirts so that I can make a lot of money. <laughs> okay, enjoy. Uh, use my link down below to sign up for Merch Informer and I will talk to you later. Bye everybody.